Finally, Matterport have made the Insta360 X4 and X5 compatible with their software. It's been a long time coming, I know. A lot of you have been asking me in the comments below, when are they gonna be compatible? And I've simply had no answer. I've been as much in the dark as you guys, but I was out doing a shoot with my Pro 2 camera the other day. I opened up my, my Matterport app on my phone, and the first thing that popped up was saying, X4 and X5 are compatible. And I said, whoa, 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 stop. Is this true? So obviously I had to go and test this out pretty quick. And I have to say at first, I was a bit let down uh, because I opened it up, got it linked up, it linked up just fine and I kept getting loads of errors. And I was like, oh my God, Matterport, you've done it again. You've told me it's compatible and it's not. I could only shoot on the 18 megapixel setting, not the 72 megapixels that we want to use. But then I downloaded the new firmware and um, I sort of jumped the gun a little bit because it did go onto the Matterport site and it did say you need to have the latest firmware updated. So make sure if you are gonna use the X4 or the X5 with the Matterport software, make sure you've updated your firmware with either camera because once I did this, it all started working absolutely fine. Connected it. I've actually done a, um, an example around this office, which you can check out. I'll put some um, examples of the screen now and I'll put the link below so you can check this out. I've just done about sort of 10 or 11 scans and it worked fine, pretty much. Like I did get one error message, but then I did the scan again and it did align it. And um, it does say on their site, I'll put this on the screen now and again, I'll link it below, that it is still in a beta version. So I think there are gonna be a few little niggles here and there as I found, like I did get that one error message but over the scans, it didn't really hold me, hold me up too much because if you take a look at this um, example scan that I've done, like I say, there's 11 in it and it took me about pff, like not much more than 10 minutes. So it didn't really hold me up that much, but I guess if you're doing a big property and you did keep getting those error messages, it could be an issue. But um, have a go, see what you think. Let me know if you've had any issues with it in the comments below. But it's just great news that Matterport finally done this because they did drag their heels a bit because RealC were on this. They um, linked the X4 and the X5 quite a while ago and I've done some videos about that and you can check those out on my channel too. So it's good that Matterport finally caught up and made these cameras compatible. Like, I don't know why it's taken so long. I don't know whether it's because they wanted people to buy the Pro 2 and Pro 3 cameras, but they've finally done it because loads of people have got these cameras and a lot of people, like I say, have been asking me when they're gonna be compatible. So it's just great news that they finally are. So. Like I say, check out the links below of um, about the sort of beta version that it is and also check out my example. But um, great news all around, I think. And thanks for watching. And if you've not already subscribed, please do. I'll see you all in the next one.